Community Television. You're watching West Hartford Community Television. You're watching West Hartford Community Television. You're watching West Hartford Community Television. For the community, by the community. Hi everybody, happy holidays! Happy Welcome. holidays! Happy holidays. Cheers. Cheers. It's Cheers. December, a new month, a great month. We are past the election. We are happy. We have wine. Hopefully everyone had a great Thanksgiving. We are in the holiday right. spirit. We're in right. the holiday spirit. We have our lights up. We have red wine again. Yes. And we had <laughs> we a great Santa hat back we have here. Great retreat. We have we Santa. We did. We had a really nice did retreat. Oh my god. That it was, was so um, fabulous. A needed getaway. I it think. was. Yeah. And absolutely. an opportunity for us to not only bond but plan our right. um our 2017. Right. Productive, a little fun, productive. A little work. Yeah. Right. A little rest, a little massages, a little facials. Oh, we did a little yes. bit of everything. Yeah. I it was, was nice. running. It was fun. Yes. Yes. Really right. Right. Oh, we went to the gym, Carol. <laughs> we did. We right went here. to the gym. Really? We went to the we gym. Just laid we just laid. laid. These girls were and laying in the stop. sleeping yeah. area. Yeah. We were yeah. sweating our butts yeah. off. Fabulous. You guys but were missing one person. Yeah, we oh, did. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Ariel. Yeah. Sorry. Next time. You don't want to hang with us. We didn't think Paula would appreciate you coming with four women. Yes. But you know, we are right with you. Next year, next year. Next we year. Adria kept us in yes. gear, Contest. right on line. That was a little bit hard she because sometimes the agenda. attention span was yeah. not always there. I think there, we had like a four-hour span <laughs> yeah. of just post-its everywhere. Yeah. yeah, and a lot of cheese and crackers. And, oh yeah. Uh, I'm excited though because we have some great shows. We do. Really we do. Good. For the year, and so we have a great vision of where and the new show's going. Um, ideas yeah. that we're going to unveil in January. Yep. Fun. Yeah, so if you want to come on our show and be a guest or be in the audience or just be part of it or come out with us afterwards, that's fun too. Coming out. Oh, yeah. yeah, the after right. part is good. Yeah. Definitely. Let us know. You know, tag us on Facebook. Let us know because we are fun people. Right. And we fell here in West Hartford at Town Hall. It yeah. takes about an hour and a half. Yep. And or a little bit longer. And then yeah. we're out after. Depending on how right? on task we are. Yeah. But yeah, we'd love to have you. It was a good retreat. And we went to the... Um, Cranwell oh, Spa, which I, is in Lenox. I had so yeah. many people asking me at work, How where, I saw on Facebook, where is this? Yeah. Like, I think a handful of people are going now because of us. We should totally get like it a was, kickback. That's what I mean. So beautiful. next year it should just it be free. Yeah, have freebie. Yeah, we really, was, although we really foliage, gave them their money's worth. I mean, we were kind of we gorgeous. The castle, night. there was, was a nothing. shuttle bringing us We were a little high maintenance. Sweet to the restaurant. Yeah. I mean, it was really nice. It is a beautiful place and it's only a little... A little like an hour oh, yeah, and a yeah, half yeah. away. Yeah, oh, and we also filmed something while we were uh, there. Yes, we did. We, we did. We filmed. I don't know if anyone, if we've all heard of Musical.ly, this app that these young girls. If you have a girls, tween yes. or a teen, you've heard of Musical.ly. It's like uh, part of your life. Right. Yeah. And so we decided to do a mom's Musical.ly on our car ride back <laughs> from the Berkshires. Which was crazy. And it was it was, it was funny. Yeah, it, it was funny. But it was funny. I almost drove off the road a few times. <laughs> I almost flew out the window with my head going each way. <laughs> that was so funny. That was such a great music. <laughs> that was Mario, don't you want to be in our next one? Sure, our next I'm, I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing. but. <laughs> well, I think we're gearing up for another musically to send Ella. I can right? imagine, though. Or we'll right. send her that one. Or we'll send her that one. one. Why mess with perfection? Right. <laughs> right. We're really, really like we'll the, improve, we'll improve. the hair flip that Cammie did in that. <laughs> Yeah, it was not good. It was Carol was crazy. in the front. We said dance, and this is her dance. Yeah. <laughs> and I was yeah. literally flying <laughs> through into me. Yeah, into, into Lori. Into my but to good. give you a preview yeah, of some really of our good. upcoming shows, you know, one of the things we talked about was um, social media and the power social media has on our tweens right. and our teens. And we were a little bit like investigative, like PI moms. Because it was just very surprising to see the things that are kids, friends, and everybody's exposed to. That was, I think, on the biggest Instagram. surprise for we me. We were on right. Instagram, right. yes. Yeah. We weren't even going into other. No. So we're going to dive into that a little bit more. Yeah, we're going to be doing... Because there's, a, there's a real issue, especially in our town and our schools. Right. 
with, with what's I going on everywhere. in social media. And, right. you know, after, after we came home that day, I sat down with Gabriella, mm-hmm. and Carol did too. We just pumped her with like... We did. We grilled her. We had like a big light on her. <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> Poor girl. We were, she was like, everybody talks. I was like, what? <laughs> mm-hmm. Like, it's shocking. Yeah, I told my yeah. kid that my eyes are on them, 24. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but anyhow, so wrapping, so today. Today, we have, I think this is like the best show ever. I'm sorry, I might be, might be biased, days. but How I am like, a, we have such a great show. Do it yourself for the holidays. Simple, elegant, Love it. unique. We have the people, for uh, the ladies from Blaze and Bloom. We're gonna talk a little bit more about that. They're gonna show us some of their inspiration and what you can do at home and what we all can do as well. Even if you're not, not so crafty, Exactly, maybe. on a budget, not crafty, things you have laying around, things that haven't been used in a while. You just keep them in your tubs and you say, I don't They're gonna use show that. us how They're to do it. it. Yeah, it's awesome. right. We're excited to right. have Jen. We are so excited. So we'll have be back. more fun today. Yeah, we'll be back. Yes. Okay. So welcome back, everybody. I am so excited to introduce my good friend, Jen. O'Connell with Blaze and Bloom. Hi, the- Hi. Hi. Yeah. Hi. Thank, Thank you, you so much for having me. I am so excited and to be here. And to Julie, who's in the audience. Yes. Yes. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you, guys. Awesome. Beautiful. Beautiful. And Gorgeous. so Julie Thank owns Blaze and Bloom. Yeah, uh, Julie Jen. and Jen, and along with their two other partners. Yeah, we have Katie and she's going to talk more about that, and she's going to show us our do-it-yourself. Oh, and we're so excited. Gorgeous. Thank you so much for having us. We are really, really honored. And we just love doing fun and different things for the holidays. So this is such a great, you know, fun way to do things. love Blaze and Bloom. Oh, thank you. Oh, I feel like it's my happy place. Tell me the apology. I just walked in. Tell everybody a little bit about Blaze and Bloom and how you all started. All right. So we're five years old. Old now we're really excited about that. Um, Blaze and Bloom started uh, for you know with four fabulous women who loved vintage and, and loved looking for you know beautiful things, and we started in um, actually Julie's backyard and we displayed wow. everything and showed people how they could use things that you know out of the box kind of things and uh, we started selling there. Uh, we had two shows. One was Bloom, and the other one was Blaze. Bloom was our spring, and okay. Blaze was our fall. Okay. So it's mostly things that you pick up at estate sales, or uh, we do. Sales. Yeah, estate sales, flea markets. Um, we also do a lot of auctions, and you never know where you're going to find things. And you yeah. repurpose. Yeah. We repurpose that, that. things. We paint some furniture, right. or we'll take things and make them into something else. We've taken old televisions and made them into bars. Oh, and we I saw that. Yeah, yeah, we do like really fun and off the cuff. Cammy and I have a. Um, a window. Oh, we have yeah. A, I have some yeah. Our, yeah. Before yeah. you get started, I want to say these awesome earrings. Oh, nice yeah. But so also, um, one Saturday morning, I turned on the TV, and I watch HGTV, like, oh, religiously. The and there's Jen and one of her partners, um, uh, Katie, Katie. Katie. Yeah. Yeah. On, on Flea Market Flip. Yeah. And of course, oh, they won. Yeah, yeah. 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 we did. We were so cool. It was really so fun. not quite HGTV. No, 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 anything. 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 We love it. We love it. We really want to bring, bring yeah. it up. Uh, well, it's a good platform. No, for we love it. Absolutely. Yeah. And just so you all know that where we're located, we're at 45 yes. New Park. Uh, it's the shops at 45 New Park. So right by the Home Depot, Raymore and Flanagan, there's this really cool brick building yeah. there. So and there's fun. so much love cool it. stuff inside. Yeah. yeah. Especially Blaze and Bloom, That's I like to say that. And but, I feel like um, I find a lot of um, unique gifts. So yes. So, like, teachers, like, like yes. you're talking so about true, teachers' Adrian. gifts. Yeah, we like to, to focus on local, especially we have some local artisans as well that um, sell at our shop as well. So we do have really fun and unique pieces, especially, like, a vintage brooch or, you know, things like a teacher wouldn't yes. really yes. expect to get. Right. Um, we have That's really so much fun better, I think, absolutely. personal than, like, a Dunkin' Absolute. Donuts gift. Yeah, card. well, oh, yeah. Yeah. they do love their coffee, but, no, I'm all you, about the local. And they wrap it so cute. They, they yeah, little bag. Yeah. Like, I think yeah. so every time I go in, I find I see new things. Oh, like, oh, yeah. oh it's, it's, it's eye candy. candy. It's eye candy. It yeah. and it's stuff that you repurpose. Yes. Stuff you wouldn't think. Okay, I'm not gonna. This is for something, but you've right. done something entirely different, which yes. is so cool. Well, that's kind of what we're doing here yeah. today. So, yeah. what we have here. Have, have, so it's happy holidays. Happy holidays. holidays. I know. So it's, I can't us. believe it's already I December. Know. We're know. doing this, but I know. It's really exciting. Hey, they need inspiration. So on, this is the, the whole idea of what we're doing here today is to show you things that are in your home that you may not think of using to d- um, decorate or things that you can get at your local grocery store to just a quick pickup so that you're not like hunting for all of right. these items. So the first thing that we would like to, you know, show you is like, okay, so how many people got one of these big bad boys oh, yeah. when they got married? Right. Right? Okay. Yes. I know, right? So, so we all have some sale. crystal. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> so we have Granny's crystal or this is something that you got from, you know, your wedding and you kept it, but you're not really sure what to do with it. Right. So our idea is to take 
Now, ready? Carnations. I'm not a big fan, right? No. This lovely piece right here. Look how, here. Look how beautiful this is. Oh, beautiful. This is carnations. I would never know that those are carnations. No, those are carnations oh. that we, we put into a little mini crystal vase. Um, but the first thing that we had to do was to get a floral ball, a floral okay. orb, if you would. That's Where what do you this get is. That? So you <laughs> can get this at your local craft <laughs> store. Um, oh. Or, you know, there's a lot, most likely I would say Michaels, right, but that's right, really okay. what you want to do. Okay. Um, and if you want to feel that, feel that yeah. for me. If you have like, it's oh, almost yeah. wet. It's okay? wet. Exactly. So what you have to do is soak this for a couple of hours before you put your okay. flowers in because if you put them in right away, they will die. Okay. No, oh. they will die okay. right away. Sure. They need that moisture need that right water. away. Mm -hmm. So um, what you will and do is. And they sell it just like a ball. Just, just like, like a ball. This. And this is a four and a half inch orb, but you can go bigger. So like you can see, this one doesn't fit in here. Right. But you would do like a bigger or six and a half one or go. Going up. This is a four and a half done Beautiful. in here as well. So what I'm going to show you really quickly is I have another size here, and you just place the ball really yep. simple. It's yep. holding it for you right over there. If I mind my reach here, I already cut up a little bit um, of roses. So we did little mini roses um, because we did the carnation. So we wanted to show you with a different flower. Okay. Really simple. Just grab it by the base here and press into the ball. So oh. how much of a stem do you leave? So you then? have about an inch okay. of a stem, okay? okay? Mm -hmm. And you what you're going to do morning? is you're going you're to do it in, in I'm surprised my like wife. almost like an arch, like All a right. straight line okay. across so the ball, the okay? Arch. And notice I'm not doing it right up against each other because I want the flowers to flow <coughs> and be open and not crushed. I want that flower to be yeah. able and to open. open a little bit more. Yeah, and to probably. let them open a little bit more. Now, I don't want any green to show, so I'm peeking over here, and I'll show you that not yeah. any green is okay. showing. Right, right. Okay? So pretty. So you start with doing it that way all the way down and around. Then you just have a friend come over and say, hey, will you come over and help me? Hey, and this is something you can do with your kids, too. That's the right. fun thing. It's like, right. hey, you guys want to do a craft them project. Them. Let them do the craft. They and love then it makes, And then it makes it all worth it. So then once you're done doing your line over the entire piece, <clears throat> you just keep on going, cutting your flowers here and there. You want to keep cutting for me? I, I, do would, that? I would love to do that. I love having assistance. It's so fabulous. And then you just go back to the top and, again, place it and, and just do keep like going. Another arch. Another <laughs> arch. And see okay. if you can see how pretty this is. Is, and it's already starting to take shape. And Jen, so you don't need water in the vase? You don't need water in the vase. What you do so need to do, thing. though, there's no water in this vase. Um, you the but you just, the ball, ball is soaked. soaked. You're fine. Soaked. Yeah, um, right. The whole thing is soaked. And what you can do is pour water over it at, like every, so well, I would say every day, just trickle some water over it. You just trickle it like that. Or you can spray it as well. And that keeps the ball that fresh. That keeps the ball fresh. Just a little and, bit yeah, of water. Just yeah, just a little bit of water. Out. You don't want to overdo it. make this? I made that yesterday. Oh my God, it looks yeah. beautiful. So gorgeous. if you just see here, we're just trimming them up here and just keep going and going. Look how pretty yeah, this, this is. is so much so and it's not taking gorgeous. me that much time. No. And the nice thing about this is, is that once you get everything done, say you have two vases and they're the same size and you're like, oh, what am I going to do? You know, this doesn't look good because they're like right on top of each other. Let me just pour this over here. You take your handy dandy little cake plate here and just oh, stack it. So and do it here, okay? Like just that. different heights. Oh and you can gosh, do that in the so center pretty. of your holiday table. It makes such a pretty piece. So and it's pretty. something that using something you already have. Right. Right. The, and then look, take a little, like another little crystal dish, put a little elf in there, you know, yep. just oh. throw oh. a little yeah. whimsical piece in so there. And it's, the yeah, I would the never shelf. These are the old school ones. like taking a candy dish, I don't know why, and putting an elf in there. Yeah, like, but you just... But so cute. It's, it's just stuff that you can take something that's really pretty mm -hmm. and really just has that shine and that sparkle and do something new with it. And you so. know, really economical on the carnations. Yeah, the carnations are definitely the right price point for you. I think you can never get a vase at the flat. Like when I cut my flowers and my face, they don't ever really look right. Like this, this is like a crisp, you know, yeah, like really, like really you know, beautiful. Yeah, yeah, it's like a this really ball, crisp look. I know. Yeah. yeah. So no, it's very crisp so and pretty. clean, yeah. and, yeah. Awesome. and and people will be like, "Where did you get that?" And you're like, right. "I yeah. made yeah. it." Yeah. Yeah. Right. And it looks so much better. You could put yeah, you could put something totally sparkly. Absolutely. There's. He's gonna be putting the elf on. I know. Put he's, the elf he likes on the, the ball elf. and he, work around. You it. could put pine cones in there too. I mean, just think about it. If you just put a, put a couple pine cones, oh, in there, you go crazy. Pine cones are gold. So tell us about. The oh, I know, right? The fun pine, pine cones. So I'm going to move this guy over here a little bit so we can talk more about my, the pine cones right. and the fun stuff. Over Which here. I love. This is my favorite. So, I know. We have to move my my ball over here. 
Do you need Mario's? Okay. Be um, no, I'm the bartender. The I know. You you do it all. Here, Mario, would take that for me? Right. Don't break it. I've had it for 20, almost 20 years. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So um, we want to talk about this beautiful piece right here. So this is an old wooden box that was in. I love this. I yes, have this to say, you can find, this is a beautiful box. You can, now, if you don't have anything like this, you might have a crate or something like that. But, you know, if you're looking for something really cool and authentic, you Go can to come store. to Blaze and Bloom Vintage. Yes. Um, but the fun thing is, is that, you know, after you purchase, this is an old factory box. Um, we took, this is one of my favorite things, a spray painting with gold. Gold is very hot and copper. Those are the metallics that are really hot this um, season. Artichokes. I was just gonna, These are artichoke? fresh artichokes. Great. Okay, great. just bought them at the grocery store. Love it. Picked up some gorgeous pomegranate. pomegranate is such yes. a lovely oh, holiday. It's just awesome. such a holiday color. And it yeah, just is such a beautiful <laughs> pop of color. So my favorite, rust -oleum. <laughs> It's the metallic. So it has to have the shiny cap. Okay. That's the where you're going to get the biggest shine okay. from. Now make sure you shake it for two minutes. Everyone goes like this and then try to spray it. And it right. goes, and right. so you don't want to do that. Okay. You want to make sure you get, and That's like the expert one and two minutes. back. Yes. Okay. Do not go close. It creates a puddle. Uh -huh. It tells you on the can, 10 to 12 inches. Go buy that. You can maybe okay. go eight Listen inches. The right. Right. I'm, they, it really makes a whole difference. Oh, okay. um, what um. I do is like, you know, go outside, light everything on a piece of paper, spray right. it, walk away for about 15 minutes flip everything and spray the other side. Beautiful. You should be good to go. Another thing you can do with kids, older kids can do this, and I wouldn't recommend the younger kids. Right. And please make sure you do something outside. You wanna make sure the air is, oh, yeah. you know, right. this is, the ventilation is absolutely important. But putting important. the paper down, I think, is a good idea. Yeah, paper. I sprayed and like, air. Paper, paper and air. And my husband, looked, David, came home um, and he's like, way. why is half the grass orange? Yeah. Like, but it will grow and you can cut it. So right. that's an okay thing. Okay. I tell See? my husband all the time, I'm like, listen, I always just pick a far corner so he doesn't know. <laughs> yeah. right. right. I'm like, oh, I'm sorry about yeah. that. But you can just lay them so in the box So don't do this here. in your garage. Or don't do it in your garage. It? Okay. And this is the best. This is free. I this is it. anywhere. Take it. a walk in a, in a park go with your kids. Go right. on a, yeah. How, who's going to get the biggest pineapple? We're so making right. Who's going to get the, We know. should have a mom's time out craft night. We'll yeah, show we should. Show. You could come over at Blaze and Bloom. It. We do we craft have, nights. I, I was going to say, I bet you a couple of craft nights. We did a pumpkin. We did a pumpkin. We did a pumpkin. I made the best pumpkin. I love those And these are, look, Holly from some of my neighbors. I just went over and said, can I, can I? You know, cut some holly, right. and they're well, like, look oh, sure. nice they look sprayed. You know, yeah. so yucky and The spray boring. definitely yeah. does so it. So how long will these, kind of a dumb question, but will, how well, long no. will these last? Well, real. These are real. So these will probably last about four or five days, and yeah. then you're going to have to be like, okay. And don't Reset. make dip. Right. This is not anything that you want <laughs> right. to, no. to, to use, okay? <laughs> also, a very important piece are these little fairy lights. I don't know if the camera's oh, catching the them, but they're lights. so beautiful. beautiful. They're battery operated. These actually have a timer, um, so that if you don't want to deal with it during your party, Yes. Set the timer. Um, you can get these so, for five dollars. Yeah, you can get them Oh, Marshall. Yes, Marshall is any place. And they uh, have different I mean, wires. Okay. okay. All right. I have to so go that's and speaking of. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You should get some, awesome. some of these. They really are great. Um, so that's really how you can have fun with um, the spray and okay. do um, like and, and do things that are really inexpensive. Um, and next, what I'd like to show you is a really neat way of books. Something to use books. I know, oh, I know right? So, so books crazy. are. Mari, we take that for yes. me, darling. I feel like I'm just no like problem. throwing things all your way. Nope. Um, thank you. Uh, no, you're fine. I can just scoot over here. So uh, again, so cake pretty. stands are such a great thing to have because mm -hmm. they really elevate things. This is great for a centerpiece and a table. But I like doing things in multiples. So if you have one already finished, you can. Sorry, you can do. Get, grab another cake plate and do another tree. So, um, so if you pairs, can see here, like pairs. pairs. I like pairs okay. or threes. Threes are really the best way because you can kind of go around everything in that regard. Here, I just took some books and started stacking them and made them smaller and smaller and rotated them. Um, then we topped it. This is an old bed spring um, that I, I just thought was, was so thought whimsical. It was so yeah, oh, yeah, it's not. A, it, it could be a tree top. It looks like the thing you put French fries in at Max. Oh, oh, it does. Oh, it, yeah. <laughs> you're always thinking, Kim. <laughs> wow, well, it's uh, tonight, though. And, and, uh, and how do you know? Like, I would never like say, "Oh, oh this is bed spring." Right, right, right. right. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, yeah, that's why. Well, you you could do it without the bed spring. You could find a vintage ornament that'll sit and get some double sided tape and stick it on just like that. Um, I'm actually going to show you really quickly what to do, um, let's see, with this piece right here. I'm going to show you a different book um, to do, a different book tree, if you don't mind me saying that. Yeah. Um, 
So what I'm going to do here, talking and turning my back, I apologize. So um, here's a series, and this is the best thing, old books too, it's encyclopedias, because some people have encyclopedias, and they're like, what do I do with them? Now this is an older encyclopedia, but I'm just going to show you. This is a book stand that we took, but you could actually take anything and, and kind of shove it in between. Wait do you see what happens. So I'm going to lay the book, this here, and just full, open each piece, right, and lay them on top of each other like this, okay? And it's starting to look like a Christmas tree. tree. A tree. So okay. clever. And then you could stick anything in the front, like a couple of pine cones to, you know, mm -hmm. put the decor in front of it, a pomegranate if you wanted to, put it in front. You could take your little guy and have him sitting on top of it, just like a little party so going on here. That is adorable. And Another you set of lights, throw them up, yeah. and, yeah. and, and now if you notice here on this tree too, I took some of Grandma's old pins. I was just going to say, you see inside the pins, right. and yeah. just stuck them it in between the books. Yeah. Yeah. I love that. And again, the holly the here too. To right, oh, so you can do so, right yeah, isn't that cute? And remember those old pins, so like from Avon, yes. yes. like you're just like, what do I do with this? Oh gosh, I have so many of those little pins. Yeah, you can just throw them anywhere, or you can just throw them on the table, like Adrian just did, no problem. You can break the case. Yeah. Hey, I don't know how the viewers are getting a great look at this, but this is really so, just a really uh, fun yeah. way yeah. to do it. Oh, you can shove the elf there. underneath. Oh, yeah, we can put them right here. Yeah, yeah. Sit them right it's here. coming out of the Christmas tree. Yeah, see? I, I can't pretty pretty really thing. see what I'm doing. Oh, no, you know what? I would put this in a corner of my living room. Like, I oh, think yeah, this you could have so it on the corner. Much nicer, even than those, those plastic, those, you know, fake Christmas trees that you buy. There's so many great um, things that you can do. And, like, again, these are things that are around your house that you can just grab and, and, and have fun. Like, I mean, right. the, the whole idea is, like, you can do no wrong. This is not set in any specific way. Like, right. oh, it has to be perfect. Do it. Step back. If it's not exactly what you want to, play with it. Yeah. And fun. I like that you use all the, you know, the, I have yeah, so the, many right, right. Right. things like that. I know this is one of my favorite things, too. So I'm going to get rid of the books, too. I've got a bag of tricks down I have here. Such, I, yeah. You know, I'm so excited about the holidays that I can't help myself. Okay. So I'm going to give this. Oh, look at me being a mess again. Sorry. I apologize. Um, but I love, well, we had to think about the kids, too. So for yeah, the kids' tables, the kids, um, the kids can help, obviously. Course, this is right. a fun thing to do. So a lot of people have some old, can you know, you look at this. This is so much fun. <gasps> okay. That is adorable. So this is an old little teapot here oh my gosh. that we put a that. succulent in. Oh, my god! So I like to call so them, cute. like, the festive little fairy gardens. And just find, like, a little something, yeah. again, an ornament. Oh, you could even find right. it, like, a dollar oh, store. Yeah, exactly. A fairy in there. And that's so cute. Isn't that adorable? Oh, you're good. Good. What you could you do? The name of it. Is it Pete Moss? Pete Moss? Oh, Pete Moss. That's right. There's that's Moss in there as well. Mario. Oh, um, and these are mini succulents. I used to work for Lowe's. Whoa. Mini succulents you can find again at and your local so grocery store. So wait, do you just water that? So I'm sorry. I'm so spray spray these. these okay, little spray white them. things. Oh my this, gosh. This is the coolest I have thing. So many of these little cups. Like how cute is that? So how many times have you seen like this kind of stuff? Like especially your moms might have like a bunch of stuff for your kids. Oh, you use just totally it. Cut it. Just take cut them out, it, baby. Just oh take them out and do a cut. Oh my and whoop, there they go. There they go. Oh, but you can just put them into a jar. Oh my God, God I'm yeah. feeling creative. I know, right? Just throw, and you just look how beautiful they are. That is gorgeous. And you can just throw them in. Just all you look, do, boom, 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 you just throw it in there. Right, right. You just yeah. Oh, and this one's my favorite. I have one more because it's just oh, and look, and I can put it on a cake plate. This is another fun thing. If you don't have cake plates at home. Huh? Is look that at like this. a fish bowl? Oh, this it's like a fish bowl. Wow. But look, this is oh, a so cute. bowl yes. Yes. and a plate. Mm -hmm. All in one. It was epoxied together. I epoxied it, but you don't necessarily oh, have to do that. Wow. Of course you did. This guy's my favorite oh, though. How cute is he? Oh. And he is this little gnome oh. in his little fish bowl. Sweet is that. And he just, with the succulents inside, I mean, you can imagine the what just and conversations what is, what else these is that? kids would have. This is moss. The, these pieces here? Yeah. Necklace. An old necklace. Oh, okay, my gosh. Okay, so where do you get these little the goldfish? succulents? Succulents. Okay, succulents, again, local. Sometimes your grocery store will have them or your oh, local Home nursery, Depot. Home Depot, will have them. I but there are local nurseries still in West Hartford like that are still in business. So yes. yep. always see. Yep. Or always see the right. You know what? And I, like I think we even have some old fish bowls yeah, like yeah. in our basement. I mean, there's so much. all the fish that died. There's so much fun you can have. There's right. there's a lot of fun to have These again. Are beautiful. Thank you so You're much. You're so welcome. Yeah, I'm so, so happy to be here. Yeah. 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 We're all going to just go home and just start digging in our <laughs> attic. Yes. No, dig yeah. around. Go into your attics. Yes. Go so into your basement. You. Yeah. And not only 
just for the holidays, but for all the time. Yeah, you know, absolutely. Putting, bring those old things out and make them new again love in your them. home. I love that. Especially before we things. before we wrap up, give the name, give your address oh, again. Oh, right. So we are Blaze and Bloom Vintage, located at 45 New Park Avenue, which is called the Shops at 45 New Park, um, and it's. Fabulous. Like the yeah. We love the coolest place. place. Yeah. Yeah. We speaking, love it. Uh, speaking of your location. Yes. You guys took over the old DJ shop that was there? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh! DJ's out! Oh! 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 Oh!